Good morning. Welcome to <laughs> Colorful Connections with the Village Program. Today we will be making a kindness flower. And we'll be talking about different ways we can grow with kindness, be kind to our friends and to our families. So let's get started. is definitely saying please and thank you, especially if we want something. That's so that's good. the first one I'm gonna put. That's a good one, I'm gonna use that one too. Please. That is a good one. Say please and thank you. I like that one. And then I want to say another one is it's always nice to have a smile on your face, especially if you're approaching someone and they say hi to you or they want to just start a conversation. It's nice to have a smile to invite them in to talk. <laughs> always have a smile. Have a smile. That's a good one. Um, and then another way we can be kind to our friends and our family is by loving on each other. Loving each other. And that can be different ways. That can be hugging them, giving them kisses. Telling them you love them. Yep. Loving on family and our friends. Uh -oh. You can show someone you love them by sharing your toys. Yep. Helping when they need help with something. That's a good one. That is a good one. Helping one another. I'm going to put helping one another. I like that. Especially when we want help. We definitely want to um, have either whoever we might be asking for help to help us. So it's good to help others as well. Absolutely. We can listen while others are speaking. Oh, that is a good one. That's a really important one. Keep our hands to ourselves, not hitting one another. 
I think I'm gonna hang my I'm gonna hang my um, kindness flower up in my cubicle to remind me how to be kind. Yes, around me. And then if you want, you can just put it in the middle, grow with kindness, or just keep it at kindness. Up to you. But those are just a few ways we can be kind to others and also ourselves. Absolutely, I think that's important to be kind to ourselves. I'm gonna hang mine up right now. Perfect. And then also there was a string, so you know, you can always punch a small hole and hold it or put the string through and have it hanging somewhere, but it's kind of up to you guys. I put mine up right there next to my last week's activity, our origami hat. 